Mm. Mm. Really, really good. This is the raspberry lemonade so good normally with like sport kind of stuff i always think i don't know i'm not really sure about this this is delicious this tastes like real proper lemonade oh oh mama, mama, mama. <laughs> just what i wanted <laughs> but no you guys seriously this is delicious i'm gonna drink this down like a margarita, like a, like a proper good margarita. It doesn't smell like a fakey one, if that makes sense. It smells like you went to a Mexican restaurant and they just handed you this. Yes, just a minute, okay. Oh yeah, okay. I am still so surprised. <laughs> it's like, normally when you try something out and you're like, you're sitting there trying to like sometimes it's like you're sitting there trying to choke down the product because you bought it and so you want to like you know throw it down the hatch because you paid for it but like this is actually legit really good and I've been enjoying drinking them so I'm really I'm really excited about this okay day three here we go <laughs> The sound my air conditioner is there I'm in the camper and it's super loud and crazy but we're gonna make it work so now I'm going to give this splash charged a whirl so um, I'm actually really enjoying the charged um, caffeinated packets that have come with the 10-day experience um, everything has been super delicious and yummy and I cannot wait to give this a whirl so let's get it in this shaker cup and get it down the hatch that's not oh my god I got powder in my eye <laughs> in a colada it smells very good oh my gosh I'm gonna enjoy drinking this so and I bet I just want to keep smelling it it smells really good it smells like a little bit coconutty like a coconut coconut cream pineapple citrus Ooh, but let, let's get this mixed up okay moment of truth here we go mmm this is this is a spilling apparently this is very good I should I'm a I'm a hand tugger I talk with my hands a lot so don't do that with your ketones this is very very good I'm gonna go enjoy this this is this is a treat mm -hmm. all the flavors have been awesome so far really happy about that so all right there we go splash down the hatch like sour like candy like a lollipop like a blow pop yeah that's good it's like oh no it's more like a watermelon sour apple very good definitely get that one too I want all of them <laughs>
Hey guys, so that is my 10 day experience and I thought I would just tag on a little bit of information on the end of this video. So for people who are curious, who want to try it and things like that, they can get to know. So for me, if you don't know, I have multiple sclerosis and um, I've been struggling with my weight for a number of years and I've been on the keto diet for almost uh like a good six months now, like a good solid six months. I'm down about 30 pounds and it kind of stalled a little bit and I wanted to try the 10 day experience to try a pack of ketones, see how they would help my body. So um, for my experience personally, it helped me lose a ton of inches. So off my stomach, you'll see like I'm pointing towards my shirt, there's like a big gap. Uh, this is the shirt that I was wearing at the beginning of the video. My stomach has gone down significantly, a little bit on my thighs and on my butt. This is the beginning of my journey, so like I still have a long ways to go, but I feel like it really helped to just push a lot of toxins out, a lot of water out, all the things. So um, yeah, it is really, really exciting. Now there are a few things. So like in the, you will not lose a ton of weight at first. What's going to happen is that your body's going to hold on to that fat for as long as it's as it can, right? And then about midway through your 10 day experience or even towards the end, you'll feel like a big whoosh effect and everything, all of a sudden your weight will just go boom, and it'll drop. And I was a bit frustrated for a while because I was a bit cheeky and I weighed myself halfway through and I was like, oh man, I gained, I gained weight. But this is your body like holding on to water weight, holding on to all those things. It doesn't want to get rid of, right? Because it goes, oh, what am I, like, this is what I've been using. This is what I rely on and I, I don't want to get rid of it. And then eventually it just goes whoosh and it comes off. So don't panic. Don't worry. And then for me, because I harbor a lot of inflammation and things like that, um, this journey has been very healthy and helpful. And so like my weight loss is coming a bit slower than um, a typical person on keto, but I feel like the ketones did help. I love, I appreciated them every single day. They helped me with my energy. They tasted good. I just felt like I was more vibrant and it wasn't like I was hopped up on like 50 cups of coffee, but I just felt good. Um, like it was what my body really needed to get through the day. And I worked, um, I did intermittent fasting with that as well, which I loved. I would just, I would fast and drink that. I would graze on it throughout the morning and it was fabulous. It helped me cut my cravings. Um, it helped me to reduce my want for sugar. Um, even though I have not eaten like table sugar, you know, granulated sugar, I still feel like I have that want and that need for, for those types of things, whether it's like fruit or whatever else. So it was really, really great. Um, if you guys have any questions or comments, uh, please kindly leave something below and I'm looking forward to connecting with you. So, um, that's right. At the end here, I need to leave my, my, um, my final weight after the 10 day experience. Pretty exciting. So, all right, guys, take care. Thanks for stopping by and we'll see you in the next video.